while the internet is trying to solve the mystery of why LLMs always guess 27 as a number, Google Gemini has expanded its model family with a general availability of two models. And unfortunately, there is a big twist with these new upgrades of these models and not a lot of people noticed it. It's very subtle in the Google announcement. And that is what we are going to talk about in this video. Gemini 2.5 Pro and Gemini 2.5 Flash. And it has also upgraded Gemini 2.5 Flash Lite into the preview mode. There are three different models, 2.5 Flash Lite, 2.5 Flash, 2.5 Pro. These are not new models completely. These are existing models that are GA. That means generally available for anybody to use. So if you're building a software, then you can use this model. Now, what is the twist that you're thinking? The twist here is that Google has updated its pricing mode into a standard pricing rather than having a thinking versus non-thinking pricing. I'm going to give you a comparison and then you're going to be surprised how much the new models are going to cost you. Let's take 2.5 flash preview versus the new 2.5 flash for comparison. So previously 2.5 flash had two model prices. One is a non-thinking price. Then there is a thinking price. To make it simpler, Google has decided that I'm going to have only one price for output tokens. So if you're not familiar with LLM model uh, pricing, there is generally an input pricing token, which is how many tokens that you are giving as part of the input. And there is an output token and how many tokens that the model is going to output, like spit out. And within that, there are like two segments. One is what it uses when there is a thinking mode on. And then the other one is when there is no thinking mode on. And there is like certain way you can control the thinking mode. And I'm not going to talk about the context caching for now. So, but if you see this model, so the Gemini 2.5 flash preview and Gemini 2.5 flash, it's literally the same model. It's just general availability. Now, first of all, there is an increase in the input price. So the price has become double. So from 15 cents, for a million token input, it has become 30 cents for a million token input. This is applicable for text, images and videos. It's a double increase price, like 2x. And then if you see the output price, so maybe you don't care about the input price. But if you look at output price, now the current price is $2.5. So for 1 million output token, this is $2.5. And now that if you compare it with the thinking mode, you might be like, hey, um, this is good uh, from $3.5. It has become $2.5. But not a lot of questions actually would have required thinking, especially when you are using 2.5 flash preview, because you might have gone to 2.5 pro or some other advanced models than using a lighter version of the model. Now, if you compare it with the non thinking price, then from 60 cents, it becomes $2.5, which is a huge increase in the cost. And this cost uh, increase is applicable across all the levels. Like, for example, even the context caching. So you can see here, this is uh, three cents, 3.75. And here it is almost seven cents. So again, once again, you see the double of pricing and this is just Gemini 2.5 flash. Strangely, this price change seems to have affected only the 2.5 flash, which is technically one of the most popular models of Google because it gives the, it used to give the trade off between speed and cost. But I'm not sure if it is the case anymore because now, you know, with the increase in price, now there are a lot of more competitors coming into that particular price segment and it might become very tough for Google to retain certain users. But if you're into the GCP ecosystem or the Vertex ecosystem, then you might still keep on using 2.5 flash. But I would love to hear from you. What do you think about this new set of models? And also, if you think the price increase is valid and in the age where everybody is expecting model prices to go down, almost like everybody saying that model prices will go down to zero, almost like negligible. This increase shows that when companies want to make money, they're going to increase the cost of these LLMs. Let me know what you think about it. See you on the video. Happy prompting.